Hey guys, it's Synergy here. Um, today I'm going to show you a tutorial on how to use the focus frame. So something such as this. Um, it's basically a frame that you can put on someone that's not your target and you can see when they're casting, you can see their buffs and you can also focus cast on them. Um, for example, I'm going to show you something here. So I'm targeting Jellyfish, right, this priest over here. I can cast a Shadow Word Paint on him. And if I use Control 3 which controls my focus cast, I can also cast one on Varen without switching my targets to him. Now what I'm going to show you here guys is something that's really useful for priests. If, you, if you're watching this and you don't play a priest then it's probably not going to be that useful to you but it's going to at least tell you and show you how focus frames can be used. Now I'm going to show you Shadow Word Poly Break. Shadow Word Death Poly Break, that's what it's called. See, I've got Jellyfish targeted, but I've got Varen as my focus frame. I can see when he's casting. He's going to cast Poly me right now. I'm going to break it with Shadow Word Death. Now, what I did there was I cast Shadow Word Death almost at the end of his casting of Polymorph, and that basically means it's going to come back and hit me, and I'm going to break the Poly, because that's a glyph right here called Glyph of Shadow Word Death. Now, I'll do it again just to show you. I'm still targeting Jellyfish. Here's my target but I can see Varen's cast because that's who I've got my focus on. Here we go. And there's another example of Shadow Word Death poly breaking. Um, so yeah, that's a really good thing that priests should learn how to use. Now I'll show you how to focus cast with focus frames. See I'm targeting Jellyfish here. Let's say I'm going to Try to kill him, right? Just doing this. Say Varen's a healer. See that mage? Just, just say it's a healer. He's not a healer, but let's just say he is, right? So I can see what he's doing. He's not casting. He could be, but he's not at the moment. Now, Jellyfish fish is getting low, right? And Varen might want to heal. So I'm going to silence Varen with my focus cast. Now, I didn't silence Jellyfish because I used Control D, which is my keybind, to silence. It's to focus cast silence on Varen instead of Jellyfish, not my target. So basically what you do when you want to do focus casting, you go to interface, go to combat, and you've got your focus cast key right here. You can change it between alt or control or shift, and you can also make macros in these. Now I use control because I use shift for a lot of key binds, like shift 1 through to 6 and shift D, F, R, etc. So yeah, that's just a way, another way that you can use focus frames you can basically cast it on your focus um, but that's like a main thing of just focus frames are to watch people's cast their buffs their cooldowns and exactly what I just showed you which is focus casting now by the way just a main tip here what you should be doing with your focus frame is using it on casters mainly because you know they're essentially casters you see when they cast so you should put your focus on a caster. If there's no, if there's like, if you're in twos or something, and there's just two melee, you can put on a melee if you want. Could be some spells you want to cast on them that you can use to control. Um, I mean, your focus cast on them. But if there's a caster, you should always put on a caster. Essentially, mainly a healer. Um, it depends on who you're targeting at the moment, what the situation is. But just if there's a caster, you should always have your target. I mean, your focus on a caster because you can see what they're casting. And you can, you know, LOS and when you see it casting, or you can shadow word poly break. And thanks for watching, guys. This is just a short tutorial on how to use focus frames and how it affects your gameplay. What you should be doing is watching a focus bar or your focus frame most of the game because you can see what they're casting and you can see their buffs. You can, it's basically, you really need it if you want to get high in arenas. It's kind of a mandatory thing. Um, so, yeah, that's about it. Thanks for watching my tutorial on focus frames and focus casts and all that. Um, if you enjoyed this video, throw it a like and a favourite, that really helps me out. Um, also, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. 
comments if you want to see more more videos. <laughs> Catch you later.